Patriots asked about you. We went out. For a breath of fresh air. <laughs> the claimants to the throne will step forth in a moment. Uh-oh. <clears throat> no, we went and did so. Humpity hump. Hello, ladies and gents. There is no greater act of valor than to fight a beast cursed by men and gods. No greater deed than that done to serve the goddess. Okay. Uncommon beauty. We thank you. We will take them to heart. But now, let's begin. We have seen Bran off to the beard and must now choose his successor. The king must be wise. The king must command respect. A king must have bollocks. With no lack of men like that. Let those who feel worthy of the throne of Skellige step forward. Well, here we go. It's like dropping a mic. I should be king. Drop the mic. Five. What about the girl? Is she not? Son could not be here this day. Behold his axe. Behold his will. Okay. What about the girl? Oh. The best man, a woman, win. Okay. Don't do it, girl. What's got into her? She's your daughter, is she not? Now I know why she said she'd sail to speak her of. Ah, children. The older they grow, the more trouble they are. Come with me. All the more essential we talk now. How was it, Geralt, when Ciri was nearing womanhood? I remember well her nan, her mother, what they were like. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Ciri was impossible to control. No telling her what to do. Had to have things her own way almost always. Why do you ask? No specific reason. That's just women, brother. <laughs> They're of a similar age. But we'll speak of my children later. First, let's speak of yours. Yennefer claims Ciri's in trouble. And you seek her. Mm-hmm. That's right. If you require aid, gold, ships, anything. Barely say the word. I'll give you all I can. And I know the last lives. I'm sure of it. When the blood of Rhiannon's daughters is shed, the sea grows white with fury. I'd mark such a storm. Let's see. Let's fill him in Magic first. Magic anomaly on Ord Skellig somehow related to Ciri, or so Yennefer believes. It's my strong suspicion, but I can only know for certain by examining the site. I saw the twisted forms. Right unnatural. The druids were barely able to contain it. Explain to me, Yennefer, how Ciri might have caused this great catastrophe. I'm intent on learning that very thing, which I will do as soon as Ermion stops hindering my investigation. Don't concern yourself with him. Druids have little trust for mages, but Ermion's heart is in the right place. Am I right to assume he does not know you seek Ciri? It's of no concern to him. As I thought. At any rate, that Skellig's my eye, with my permission to investigate as you see fit. All right. Do I need to speak to him? Wondering if I should talk to Ermion. Leave that to me. Go. 
She can find your Cyrilla. If any ill befell her here, an Arch Skellig on my watch, I'd never forgive myself. Thank you. No need. I swore an oath once. I aim to keep it. Aye. Anvald, tell the druid I must speak to him. At the usual spot. I've one more matter to broach. My child. My lass. You remember, Ceres? Well, recently she declared she must set off on an adventure. To bolster her chances of winning Skellige's crown. Ah, shit. Got it in her head that Ulderic is not mad, but cursed. I'll okay. talk to Ceres. Count on it. I thank you. Now that we're done thanking one another, let's get to work. We must determine if Ciri is still on Ard Skellig. I'll change into travel attire and find you. Head south. The anomaly we should investigate destroyed a stretch of forest along the shore of the bay. A successful feast on all counts, Paul. I will see you later. Damn! Get rid of these damn clothes, put my gear back on. Okay, we need to sign for magic cataclysm. Whoa! Before it starts yelling at us, doing its yeah. Where we go? All the way over there, huh? Yeah, I don't know if we're gonna do that. Okay, so let's see what else we got going here, secondary wise. So we've got some. This is a random thing I ran into. This chick's like, nobody can beat me. So I beat her, and she's like, come to my house. I saved, I checked out. She wants to sleep with us, but we're with the universe, so we can't really do that. Anyways, so let's see. Anything, what is that? I don't know, where's that one at? Whoa. Oh, okay. Let's let it finish yawning at us. New quest, Possession. Echoes of the past. Hold on. There we go. Let's do that one. I think that's right in the area where we are. Oh, hell no. Where the fudge sickles is it? You see, oh, okay. I did a little bit here. Like I said, this is about four or five hours, right? Six hours. And then look, look at all this crap, right? I, yeah, I sailed down through here. Checked out this. This is at the very bottom of the map. Uh, going around this island here broke the game. Right, so I was thinking, oh, okay, this isn't too bad. And then I started coming up this way. Went, oh, Jesus. Oh, no, no. Oh, oh my God. No. Oh, so much to do. Uh, anyways, we need to find a signpost. All right. Okay. And we're going to want to change. Hold on. Let's see. Phantom of Eldenburg. Oh, that's a new one I just threw at us. Okay. Can I... Can I... No, no one wants to... What the fudge sickle, man? Come on now. Oh, okay. here we go. Bear school upgrades. Because the first part of the bear school stuff was the Ur uh, the Ursine armor, I think. So I wonder if there's going to be actually bear armor I get to go after. Take a quick look. Mm. Okay, so we've got Griffin School gear we can do. Bear School gear is 12. Hopefully, it'll let us do it. Wolf School gear 14. Now, this is the one you got to go to Care More in for. Okay. 
I might just do this and not make you guys follow it. I don't know. But anyways. So you're back. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. I'm gonna sell some shit off. Back to 87 pounds. Works for me. And then I don't think I need anything otherwise. Oh, there was something for the Witcher there, huh? Alright, some additional. So long. Okay. Let's look at this last one. Oh, there we go. Are hidden in the Skellig Isles. Okay. Clever enough to find them. Oh, shit. That does not bode well, especially if it's me. Okay. There we go. Alrighty, ladies and gents, we are back. And what's up, doggy? What's up, little kid? All right, where the hell are we run into? Oh, we gotta meet a girl here. Okay, she's in here, I take it. Uh oh, I wonder if she's wanna, gonna wanna bump Douglas. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's no, right. We gotta speak to this other guy first. We'll be done in a moment. And then a giant sea snake swam up and bit my arm off. The gods have spoken. A sacrifice is needed. To my mind, it's about you defeating a snake, yeah. No, they demand a sacrifice. I'm sure of it. It's time. We must wait for a clearer sign. At least till your next dreaming. I don't need no more signs. <sighs> Nothing like bullshit super superstition get people's asses killed. Mm-hmm. That's Looking right. Viserys, heard she stayed here. On Crate's daughter. I. she was here. Where is she now? Hmm. What? Ceres. Where's Ceres? Dunno. Dunno. Enough of the questions. Oh, well, he's fucked up. Okay. I'm looking for Ceres. Any idea where she might be? I hope she's gone to the village. It's been a time since she visited. She wished to speak to our folk, but... But? I worry she might have gone to Jarl Udelric's old family home, though I tried to dissuade uh -oh. her. Clan Brockvar have something to hide from the Oncrate? No, it's not. The house is a strange place. Many believe it haunted. Great. I love haunted houses. Hmm. But why would Ceres go there? Prove herself. She, left. she had a long talk with the Jarl. Seems she wanted to help him. Oh, crap. With what? Forgive me. I must go to him. A promising start. Oh, man. Remember when that storm caught us in Old Bay? 
like it were yesterday. Offcon fell overboard and near drowned. Anything in here looks like it'd be good. A chest to grab, maybe. Ah, screw it. Alright, where are we going? Oh, that's not too bad. Get in my horse and get there real quick, I bet. Yo, Rochi! Come here, baby girl, what's up? Right. Time for us to ride. At least now you guys will be able to see how good this armor is. It does make a major whoa shit difference. Come on now. Of course, I c it doesn't help me in my bad riding. But then, what can you do? Anyways, here we go. Shouldn't be too hard to get up here. Oh, Not maybe. So fast, Roach. Maybe. Uh, what is this crap? Oh, okay. This is it. All right. Whoa there, Roach. Okay. So let's see what we get to fight. Let's see. Take a look around. Oh, there's some clues this way. It seems. On the other side of the door. Let's get some. Uh oh. Fresh plans. Some good sources in here. Oh, I'm not going to let a door go by and opened. Oh, a key. See, good thing. Key to the cellar. Good thing I came in here. What's this? Oh, we'll take the riding flesh. We'll sell it off. Okay, and we'll check this one. Oh, come on, there's got to be something. Besides the damn snow, come on now. Alright. Ooh. That Saris. Uh-oh, oh no. Passed out. Got to get her out of here. Ooh. She's not dead, though. Shit. That's good. Where am I? Oh, my head. Pain's just awful. Got hit with something heavy. Kurt? Why are you here? Came to look for you. Croc's worried. Taking you home. I won't go until I help Ulrich. The sword. Where's the sword? I've, I've got to go back. You're not going anywhere. I carried you out of there a moment ago, half dead. I have to. Nah. You have to tell me what's going on. Let's start here. Why'd you go in there? I wanted to help Udalric. Sure, he was acting strangely, but I don't see how your stroll through a haunted house will help him. It would have if I'd only found the sword. So what's this sword all about? It's Brokvar, the ancestral sword of Udalric's clan. I needed to lift the curse that holds Udalric. A curse? Long story. Years ago, Udalric and his little brother butted heads over the sword. As custom has it, the clan's sword should go to the firstborn son, Udalric. But his father gave Bokfart to his little brother, Aki. <laughs> Serious insult in these lands. Oh shit. Serious enough for Udalric to break a sacred law here in Skellig. He openly questioned his father's decision. Guessing the old Jarl couldn't let it pass. They chained Udalric to a pile, up to his waist in the sea. Spent three days like that. When his punishment ended, he and Aki sailed out to fish. Mm, yep, something happened, I'm sure. Got a feeling this trip didn't end happily. Your feeling's right. There was an accident. A storm broke out and Aki fell overboard. Uderic had his hands full with the sails. Didn't hear his brother until it was too late. Didn't hear? Or didn't want to hear? Some folk on the isle had the same doubt. But none would mention it aloud. Just go for what this. What did you plan to do with the sword? I thought Aki's ghost would want it back. The brother's ghost? Long as I remember, folk have said Udalric's the chosen one. The one the gods speak to. I believed it once. But now, considering certain things, I think 
think he's just haunted. And it's his dead brother that's haunting him. So you believe Aki's getting his revenge, because Udelric let him die? I've talked to Yort. He swears Udelric didn't start hearing voices till after Aki's death. And I don't think Yort's mistaken. He knew both those boys from the cradle. I think we have to give Brokvar to Aki, and he'll leave Udelric alone. Not a bad idea, on condition it's a ghost we're dealing with. But something doesn't add up. What's that? Aki drowned at sea, said so yourself. But the ghost haunts this house. Aki and Udelric both lived here. Maybe that's why. Mm. Thanks for your help, Geralt. But I've got to get the sword. Out of the question. I'll get it. Really? Thanks. So I can go see Udelric? No chance. Your weak might pass out again along the way. Wait here, we'll go together. Smart. As always, my boy, Double G. Obviously, there's an underground area. Okay. The question now becomes, how the hell do we get down underneath? Ooh. Ooh, there are chests up there. Oh my god. Okay, there's stuff all over this place. So I wonder if we go outside here. Whoa. Yeah, here we go. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. All right. Well, that was just a waste of freaking time. And jump! Ugh! Ah. Oh. All right. Why is oh there we go there we go. Of course, as always, I've got I think yeah I got my cat. All right, that sounds like a specter. So we got our specter juice. Where's that? Oh my god, I got so many of these things now. I have gone in course in between here and made sure that I am upgrading everything I can uh oh that doesn't bode well oh sword all right what is this about Yeah, what's this bubbling shit right here? I want to fight it, whatever it is. What the hell? Of course, you know, nothing bothers Double G if you notice. He's like, alright, shit, what do I got to kill now? Does that help? Oh, that's, that's always a good sign. That means something's going to happen as soon as we... Something should happen any second now. So, to find the sword? I found it. Let's go. After you, then. Seriously? You and my dad, you were mates once, right? Hope we still are. But, well, I heard you fell out over something, or someone. Talking about that story with Yennefer? Long time ago, that. In fact, that was before Croc met the woman who'd be your mother. That you and Yennefer had already met? <sighs> uh, things were never cut and dried with Yen. What is it about her? What is it that draws you? Dunno. Maybe, uh... It's because I've never chosen comfort and ease, the calm and the quiet. Hmm. <laughs> I like my bitches crazy. Something like that. Mm-hmm. All right, come on, honey. Shit's going to hit the fan here real soon. Thank you, lass. I knew I'd be a hero. So I'm called Double G, girl. Arr, arr. It's all good. 
I hate these following quests. Here we go. Where is Yennefer? Hmm. Don't know. Why do you ask? I just wonder why she let you come here alone. What do you mean, let me? Nothing. Not a thing. Just got the impression she doesn't like to let you out of her sight. Shit. Look, there they are. <clears throat> Already bright out here. Stings the eyes. The fresh air will do you good. The gods won't be pleased. <clears throat> Jarl, our guests, remember. What happened to your hand? I sacrificed it to the gods. Forgive him, Jarl. Geralt's got more to learn about our customs. We're close to the gods in Skellige. And the chummier you are, the greater the offering you make. Okay. It's our belief that the greatest thing a man can offer is his pain, his suffering, the pure sacrifice. To hear the gods is a gift, not a sacrifice. These voices you hear. The gods, their voices. Be More direct. likely this is somehow related to your dead brother. He's going to flip on that one. We concluded that... That the gods are angry at you, yet he's the reason. That's why you have to apologize to Aki himself. I... I didn't want to. Aki fell in the water. I... The gods will be angry. Angry you want to make peace with your brother? Are the gods of Skellige that cruel? They are that just. Justice demands you return to the dead what is rightly theirs. The hell what that? you have me do? Did that little kid out there sleep? Where Aki fell in the water? Near the isle's eastern end, by the mouth of the bay, current had swept us towards Ulula's needle. It's a dangerous spot. Treacherous eddies swallow a handful of sailors each year. We need to sail there. Aki's ghost won't rest until Brockvar's returned to his remains. No. No, no, no. The gods, they'll be angry. I feel it. Fear not, Jarl. The gods love you. And they loved Aki. Surely they want this. Well, maybe I can sail there. The sword should be returned. That's what matters. Makes no difference by whose hand. Okay. We can do that. What do I look for? Did Aki have a portal to help me recognize him? Something he was wearing that could survive all this time underwater. Aye. Our clan ring. That ought to be enough. I'm off. Ah, crap. Well, we're pushing our luck on the episode length here, folks. Let's see. World map. How far is it? Oh, just right out there. Aye. Okay. Well, we'll probably start the next episode. And we'll go and we'll finish off possession and then we'll probably start. I don't know. We didn't look too much at the treasure hunts, so we got. Yeah, I might go run back and do this one and then we can do all the others together I think just to get this one out of the way get it taken care of so alrighty folks hold on when we come back we shall finish possession hold on